Welcome to Everything Amtorized. I am CA and today in this video I am going to show you how to download and install code blocks for 64 as well as 32 bit windows systems. So watch this video till end and let's get started. So basically code blocks is an IDE for running C and C++ programs. I have also made a video on how to use code blocks. So if you want you can have a look at that video also. It will be available in the description as well as in the info cards above. So before installing code blocks we first need to download it. So go to the web browser of your choice and there you need to type code blocks. And once the search is complete, you will be finding the link to the www.codeblocks.org website. So go to that particular site. And this is the official site of Codeblocks IDE. Now here you will be finding the download section in the left menu. So click on downloads. And now here we need to click on the binary release. So click on this link that says download the binary release and there you will see there are three options for us as we are on a windows machine we will be downloading for the windows machine so click on windows xp vista 7 8 10 and now here you need to choose the correct setup for your computer now as we want code blocks along with the compiler we are going to download code blocks mingw setup so there are four options for this particular case as we want to install code blocks on our system we will be going with the setup exe so there are two options for this so one is code blocks 20.03 mingw setup.exe and the second one is code blocks 20.03 mingw 32 bit setup.exe and now here you need to choose which type of code blocks you want either you want 64 bit or you want a 32 bit code blocks to find out this you need to go to your this pc and now in the blank section you need to right click and then you need to go to properties and now under the system you will be finding which operating system you are running on so i have a 64 bit operating system x64 based processor so i will be downloading 64 bit code blocks if you have a 32 bit operating system x64 bit processor then you need to download the 32 bit version of code blocks because the operating system that is the windows that you are running on your computer is of 32 bit architecture so you need to download according to your particular system so as i have a 64 bit operating system so i'll be downloading 64 bit code blocks As I have a 64 bit system, so I will be downloading this particular thing. So that is code blocks 20.03 mingw setup.exe. If you have a 32 bit one, you will be going with this. And if you have a 64 bit uh, system, then you will be going with this. Now on the right hand side of that particular option, you will be having two options. Either you can download it from FOSHub or you can download it from sourceforge.net. So I will be going with the first one. So click on it and wait for some seconds your download will automatically start as you can see that we have got the dialog box for downloading our code blocks so i will be saving this to my default download folder so it will take some time in order to download the whole setup so once your code blocks is downloaded you can double click on this download thing here or you can go to the folder where your downloads are saved so i will go to my downloads folder so i'll minimize this browser tab i'll go to this pc and then downloads and you can see that i have my code blocks set up here present what you need to do is you need to double click on this downloaded thing and now it will ask for yes or no so you need to click on yes and then it will begin the installation process as you can see that the code blocks installation wizard is in front of me now you need to click on next you need to click on i agree you need to click on next you need to click on install and now it will take some time in order to get code blocks installed onto your system so as you can see that code blocks has been installed and it is asking 
if I want to run code blocks now. So I will click no because I don't want to start it now. So click on no. And now you can see that code blocks installation has been finished successfully. Now click on next and now click on finish. Now you can close all the tabs that are present. So I close the browser tab also. And now when you go to the start menu, you'll see that code blocks has been added now. Scroll until you find the folder for code blocks onto your start menu. You need to click here to expand it. And now you'll see there are four options. So you need to open just code blocks. So this is the thing which will open code block. You don't need to click on code blocks launcher. It is something different. You need to click on code blocks. So when you click on it, you can see that code blocks is successfully been started. It will take some time depending upon the speed of your computer. And this will be the final welcome screen if you open code blocks for the first time. So as you can see that our code blocks has been successfully installed and is up now. So this is how you can install code blocks on your windows machine whether it is 64 bit or a 32 bit system. So if you want to know how to use code blocks to run your C and C++ programs then you can have a look at my video that I have posted on my channel. I will be giving the link in the description as well as in the cards above. So you can go and have a look at that video also. So hit that like button if this video was helpful and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press that bell icon so that you get notified whenever I post a new video on my channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.